Hundreds of first responders plunged into the frigid waters of Lake Erie to simulate an emergency ice rescue of a crashed commercial airliner. Volunteers played the roles of the plane's 50 passengers, some dead and some alive. Once we get out on the ice, we determine which victims are in the most need of help and, um, and act accordingly, get everyone out of the ice and then get them back to shore for EMS and get them back to the hospital as soon as possible. Congresswoman Marcy Kaptur was on hand to watch the mass rescue. She hopes the exercise will help alert the public to be cautious around the lakes. Probably the most important thing is for people who live along the lake to be responsible in the way that they use the lake. And we have far too many accidents. Those accidents making it even more important for rescuers to practice in different situations. And the second half of the mission is called the long haul, where crews use boats like the one behind me to rescue anyone who's stranded more than a half nautical mile out from shore. It's one of the most hazardous environments that you can work in, uh, bringing all these agencies together, trying to coordinate the response, keep everyone safe, and effectively perform the mission is vital. And coordination between emergency crews is what Marcy Kaptur hopes will prevent accidents and save lives along Lake Erie. Eric Wildstein, WNWO.